What's up my fellow FIFA hooligans? I'm Gaming Seth. Today, as many of you already know, the latest update to the title came out, update 1.04. This patch solves a lot of issues when you're going through the game. The screen that pops up is a laundry list of stuff that they fixed. In my personal opinion, all of this should have been fixed before the release a week ago, but thankfully they got it done pretty quickly within a week of the release so a lot of things especially in the gameplay have been fixed a lot of bugs were worked out um, one of the main things that I care about is career mode in career mode the biggest thing that you will notice is the squads have finally been updated so there are certain players big name players that should have been out on loan or transferred out and the released game was showing them still at their current clubs. Most notably, you probably saw Alexis Sanchez at Manchester United and Mauro Icardi at Inter. Both of those have been loaned out to other teams. So let's get into it. Let's check out and see some of the big changes. Uh, I did not start an actual career mode. I just went straight to the rosters to take a look in the team sheets and see what was going on here. So first thing I did was completely reset my squads and then downloaded the latest. With that, um, I did this when I first got the game and downloading the latest squads was basically identical to the game that was released. So it did not change anything and it was completely useless. This time, however, once you update the squads, you now have the most current squads in all of the big five leagues that I've seen. I have not checked outside of that, but everything looks spot on here. They've even updated the starting 11 and formations. So looking pretty good. Here I'm scrolling through looking for Chris Smalling and Alexis Sanchez, neither of which are here. So that is great news. Um, not because I have anything against those players, of course. It's just I want the latest and most realistic squads. So, anyway, let's look at Inter Milan and see if they have a Cardi there. Uh, going to Italy, here we go. Enter their formation. And there's Sanchez, so that's good. And no Icardi. So, perfect. That's also what we wanted to see. So, he should be at PSG on loan. So, we'll skip over to France and check out Paris see what they have for their lineup uh, just an absolutely absurd front four that they show there and there is Icardi on the bench so perfect guys this is one of the biggest peeves that I had with the game the only other one was the fact that when you edit players in career mode and you either save or don't save the changes you've made to them it takes you all the way back to the original uh, Austrian league and then you have to scroll all the way back to whatever country you're in whatever league you're in and whatever team you're in so frustrating process anyways that's a side note nothing to do with this video um, that's really all I have I'm just pretty pumped that they finally fixed the squads if you guys have any questions suggestions comments feel free to leave them in the section below thank you so much for watching be sure to subscribe and hit the like button if you found this video helpful